sure it's up that way. Oh my God, look how overgrown this is. This is insane. Can't wait to get inside this house so it looks absolutely amazing. Complete time capsule, but we are completely lost. Okay, as long as we're about to head inside an absolute amazing abandoned house here in France. It's pitch black. We have got here a bit late, but it is what it is, guys. We're gonna explore it anyway. This place is supposed to be huge, completely full of stuff, frozen in time, exactly what we like. We're about to try and head inside this house now, and it should be a good one. Let's do it. <laughs> inside the house now guys we're gonna have a good look around see what's left from this first room that we're in it looks like there's so much left inside it looks pretty creepy as well so guys check this room out first room looks like a kind of kitchen area but check this out old piano just left in here song sheets on the top Oh, look how old this stuff is. That's like an old uh, piss bottle. Look at the dates on these. Don't have these look so old, decrepit. Check that out, guys. Unreal. Old bottles here. Oh, check these, still got the corks in them. Look like old uh, poison bottles. What's that one say? No idea, don't speak French. But this is insane. Got an organ here as well. Completely dead. Falling apart. The nice tiled flooring. Oh, look at this. Taxidermy. Looks like a little ferret. The recorder there. Vinyl player. Wow. And check out Pumba up here size of this did you realize like wild boars were that big no that's massive no, look at the uh, tusks on him as well it looks like he's gonna look at me at any second <laughs> cobwebs hanging down <gasps> here's his leg his legs here as well derek yeah look hung up look at his little hoof is there another one yeah. oh his tail's there as well no way that's crazy there's his front leg, another hind leg and his tail just hung up on this huge stone fireplace. Check that out. Insane. Grandfather clock, but it's been broken and smashed in there. Nice little hat stand falling apart as well. There is all paperwork on the floor too. You can see where there is a bit of vandal damage. Oh my days, we're not getting through this way. Look at this completely barricaded the doors in doesn't make much sense when the windows are open but there you go all right let's head through this room heading into this room now dining room still see there's some plates and bottles on the side there oh the floor feels well dodgy but look at this corked still there's actually some wine left in there too and this one quite heavy bottles too song sheets this feels like a proper medieval house oh look at this guys marble fireplace this is unreal oh the chairs just fell apart as i touched it that's great you can see the old wallpaper peeling back the wooden beams coming down oh it's so dodgy this one. Oh, i'm scared oh the floor is so sketchy See these big joists, big wooden joists, proper farmhouse style. 
it's quite dark outside as well it's only going to get darker it is quite late oh the floor is so dodgy oh my scared the life out of me then umbrella hanging up look at the tiled flooring as well looks like some sort of earthquake there <laughs> but look how long it's, this place has been closed look at this back door wow just completely covered with thick cobwebs and dust unreal the house does look quite big from the outside so hopefully there's quite a lot to see the old furnace hidden away in here look at that guys just hidden under this I think staircase, I'm not 100% because I, I haven't looked around this place, we just come straight in here. But you still got the coal in the pot there. That would probably heat the whole house up there. More cobwebs, ooh, vile. Ah, into this kitchen area now. This looks like more like a working kitchen. Look at the fridge, we have to check in there. Oh, it's not too bad, you know, compared to the rest of the house. Actually not bad at all. Like an American style fridge. That's pretty cool. But I've just noticed these as well, the jars. All hanging up, all hanging up, all sat on the shelves still. Oh my, no idea what that is, some sort of marmalade. Look at the size of that fork though. Oh my god, what are you eating with that? It's absolutely massive. Once again, the big joists, big wooden oak joists. Oh, this one's actually got one coming down as well, supporting the ceiling. Another desk here, what's this? Anna Orchestra. Not bad condition book, really. Oh, there's a cobweb in my face, right in my mouth. Ugh. But look at this, pure nature coming through the windows. Ivy, thick cobwebs, disgusting, absolutely vile. But another proper medieval style fireplace there, quite big as well. And like the old stone worktops. This place does look like it has been used as a bit of storage for a farmer maybe. It does seem like that, but I have no idea what we're, look we're gonna see next. I am completely winging it there today. No idea where the stairs are. What's in the other rooms? Oh, there's the stairs. Look at that spiral stairs. We'll head up there next. Oh, wow. Check this kitchen out. All the tiles still intact over there. The big bars and shutters on the windows. Wow. Nice little retro cooker there. Look at these shelves though. I've seen these shelves dotted around quite a bit in France. Not really sure what they're for, but they are literally everywhere. Dining room table, seat for one. What else do we have in here? The big high ceilings, big cupboards. More shelves here. No idea, guys. Newspaper there. Is there a date there? 1978 on this newspaper. That is the latest date we've seen then, 1978. Ooh, what's that? Oh, I'm off. But look at the plates still in here. A few bowls, saucers, what have you. Loving the wooden beams. Nice touch. Like I said, the tiles. Old cooker there. Still got plates and pans inside. This is insane. The age of this place. There's a beheaded statue up here. Not sure what she's done wrong, but somebody wasn't happy with her. Wow. Another stone worktop. So it's strange seeing just the small worktops. Don't really see that much. Not really sure what that's for, but you can see there's a draining thing there. Maybe this was a sink, because you've got the wash bowls there as well. Crazy, some tiles that have fallen off. And more of these old bottles. Ooh, it's stuck to the table, vial. Denture, denture, not sure. Guys, what are we saying so far? It looks like 1970s, this place was abandoned. Absolutely amazing. 
I feel pretty freaked out by that uh, taxidermy in the other room. I am completely winging it. I don't know what's in this house. Um, we're gonna head upstairs next, I think, unless I can see another room down here. Did I look in that room? I'm not sure. Is there anything in there? A nice fridge in there. I've looked in the kitchen. I wasn't sure what this room was because there's a door there as well. Anything in there? No, in the cupboard, no. No? And that's back into that first room? Is it? I think so. Yeah, yeah back in the first yep. room. The right, upstairs then. Head upstairs. Look at these stairs though, Derek. All stone. Stone with the iron banisters. Spiraling. No, it's got a balcony too. And this is just like a normal farmhouse here. It's cra crazy. Look at the structural damage on here. This house is definitely seen better days. It is falling apart. The shutters basically saving these windows. Some of them have started to fall out already. Oh, there's proper vibes in this place as well. Look at these stairs though. I just try and imagine it as if I lived here. Look at the balcony there, actually doesn't lead anywhere, it's just a flower bed there. What do we have in here? Besides these thick cobwebs, spiders, you can see the uh, decay there. Is this like a little bathroom? I'm not sure, I'm not really sure what that is, it looks like a bathroom. Oh. And then there's out onto the balcony. As if there's going to be any electric. But once again, the tiled floors. Ah, there's some handwritten letters here. See if we can see a date there. 1890. Whoa. Handwritten. No idea what it says, guys, but 1890 on the date. 1885. Maurice. Wow. Some more here, just says 85, so I'm guessing it's 1885 the same. But how are they? How can anyone understand this writing? It's like a doctor's writing. But that's crazy that they're just sat there still. 1885. Oh, look how narrow the doorways are as well. It's proper strange. Navigating through these little corridors. Oh my days, what's going on here? The bed is floating in midair. There is all handwritten letters underneath as well. Under the bed. Maybe somebody's been having a rummage trying to find any valuables. Just trying to see a date because I'm not getting uh Oh there we go. 1859 there. Written on there. Wow. Like I said, not really sure what's going on with the bed. It has been tipped over. But, uh, you can see a nice marble fireplace here, up in the bedrooms. There's cobwebs hanging off my hand. Disgusting. Some bed sheets there. Why would somebody do that? It's so annoying. But look at the look at the gap between the window and the shutter. All those filthy cobwebs and spider skins. You can see all the spiders just chilling up there. Ugh. Probably thinking who's in my house. Old wardrobe. But you can see hidden behind this wallpaper all the structural damage, cracks in the walls. Hey Derek, mm -hmm. 1885 those handwritten letters. Mm -hmm. Wow. That's insane, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh look, this house is completely falling apart. Let's head into an, a second bedroom. Oh my days, check this bed out. Solid wooden bed there. Oh, it's still got the mattress and the pillows still on here. More handwritten notes. Not sure what year. It does say 1938 there though. Oh, there's like a secret cupboard here that's been wallpapered over, but it's just fallen apart over the years. A second marble fireplace. Oh, there's the body for the statue downstairs. 
It's Mary as well. Someone's decimated that. Look at this artwork. And it's just lying on the floor here as well. Such a shame. Anything in these frames? No, no guys, it's just like an old book. Once I said, like I said though, marble fireplace, look at this bed. Look at this big long table as well, very medieval type table in here. You can see the plasters falling down off the lathen plaster there. And it's just been untouched on this table. I wonder when these magazines are from. Oh god. Just touch that, scared the life out of me. But look at the age of this. This has got to be 40, 50 years old, surely. Look at the adverts. Wow. Oscars, 1955. Wow. That's crazy. Paris match. So there's some age to this stuff. Another song sheet from the piano downstairs. It's got some weight to it, why? What's on it? Ooh. Disgusting. Strange to have such a big table. Like, how did they even get that up here? Because those stairs are, even though they're quite big, the doorways are quite narrow. Anything hidden behind the bed that we've missed? Just looks like wallpapers fell down. More of the cobwebs. Ooh, structural damage still. Heading down these corridors, oh, I can see a rocking horse there. Heading into another bedroom here. This one seems a lot better condition. Single bed in here. Solid, carved. Look at that. Still got the mat there. Pandas on the mat. But it does look like the bed was still made. Pillows, quilt, duvet. Just gonna check out this picture up here. Like an old family picture, Victorian times. See if there's a date. I don't want to touch it actually because it looks like it's going to fall down. But that's that sepia style. Retro wallpaper. This bed's crazy though. Look at that. The old wardrobe here. Oh, big heavy wardrobe, thick wood. Wow. Oh, it's got like a school desk here. A little chair on there, wine bottles. This is so cool, another book here from 1946. That's incredible that this is still left. Check the wallpaper though, so retro. Oh, let's have a look in these cupboards. The floor in the bedrooms is tiled as well. So strange to see. Ah, oh, nothing, just coat hangers. Oh, looks like it bits out of the drawers. Oh, cool. Some books in here. Maybe get a date. 1964 exposition. Art books there. Just looking for dates on the books. 1966. But this is crazy that these are just still sat here. 1966. So many books there as well. We've got some out on the mantelpiece here. Marble again. Wow. Oh, hello. Using that as a bookmark. Oh, postcard there. But look at these bottles. Look at the corks on them. That's amazing. Oh, nearly pulled that one out. But these do look like little medicine bottles. There is still stuff in there. I'm not sure what it is though. Look at the plants as well. Dossier. Something extreme. <laughs> Look at that with the mirror above it as well. It's a shame that it's so dark, but this is just the time that we arrived. Can't be helped sometimes, guys. But we have to push forward and see these places. We've got other places to be tomorrow. It's just how it works out. Absolutely loving this room though, best room so far I think. Definitely, look at this. Back out into the hallway, look at these bottles. The dust on them, still corked. Look at the spider skins on them as well. Seen all these bottles there? 
So cool, aren't they? Like, oh, knock that one over. Definitely should be wearing my gloves, but I'm not sure what they've been keeping in here. Oh, look at these. All the wine bottles hidden away here. Looks like they've been bootlegged as well and labelled themselves. Just all hidden under this shelving. That's so cool. There's another secret shelf here too. Let's move that out the way and have a look. Oh, just all bits and bobs in here. Little trinkets. Oh, what's that? Um, oh, there's spider webs all over me. I can't even tell what that is. Something from a chemist though, it says chemist on it. So God knows what that is, but that looks so old. Let's see if there's anything left. Just more little bottles. Some broken bits in there as well, which is a shame. Cobwebs and spiders. Check out this rocking horse. Look at him just chilling. Obviously there was children here at one point. Wow. On the bookshelves, covered in dust, debris. Oh my days, look at, I'm loving these old bottles, they're so cool. And 1934 on that newspaper. These books look like they haven't been touched in decades. Oh, I just got to step over this fella here. Oh wow. Check out this bed. The carvings and the details in there. Still got the mattress and pillows. Marble fireplace seems to be a theme here. What's this? It's like an old Bible or something. The song sheets. Looks like a little ornament of, of a dog or a goat or something. I'm not sure, but it's definitely knackered. Looks like somebody's been throwing books into the fireplace as well, which is a shame. These have been empty too, but you can see where they have had bottles and stuff on the shelves, which people have obviously moved or taken. But check out this bed, that is amazing. That's so cool. Oh, I can think I just heard rats running around underneath. Just in this chest now, books and newspaper from 1929. Oh, I don't want to touch too much. La Plus Sot Animal. No idea what that means. Something to do with animals, I'm guessing, but look at this. So cool. Looks like something's been knocked off the top as if that was an eagle or something. Another little room here. Oh. oh wow, look at this bookshelf. Everything's been thrown off though. Look at this map of London. When's that from? Map of London, look, look at the cobwebs hanging off that. Oh, that's crazy. More handwritten letters. Oh, has just been knocked and thrown all over the floor. It is such a shame to see it. You hate to see it. But there's all papers, all sorts all over the place here. Oh, jeez. This must be the master bedroom here. Another big whip, uh, wooden bed there. Drawers everywhere. Geography books. More letters. But everything's just been chucked all over the place. It's such a shame. Got a little hidden cupboard there, but it's been emptied. Look at these bottles. Check out this old uh, water tin. Got the liters on there in the inside. That's pretty cool. All the cologne bottles there, all just left on the side. So cool to see. Another desk with the books. 1904 there. Wow, so cool. Absolutely loving this place. What do we have here? Who's that? Oh, is it? <laughs> It's very ominous coming up the stairs then. Boom, boom, boom. Dust. Books. There's a little shoe stretcher there. But look at these. Such an age to these books. 
inside they're still quite good condition is a shame taller Paris but they are just all completely left here it's a shame if it's been thrown around the floor that's a bit of a pain in the arse to be fair and um, the fact that these beds have just been trashed oh. oh look at that old picture a little girl there and a little hat no it is a shame guys to see it people have been in and trash the place okay guys we've got one more floor to do just gonna head through this room now just siphon through the letters there seeing if there's any dates but not really there is another staircase though gonna head up there past these old bookshelves oh a toothbrush vile but look at the books just been tipped everywhere there's a little desk under there Better head up these spiral stairs now oh my days look how high it is it is actually vile this oh my there's another stair set as well look at the ivy coming through the sunlight there check that out see what we can find oh it just goes on forever it does seem a bit trashed up here but there are so many rooms oh another bedroom oh, check that out guys all the bottles oh that's still got powder in it i wonder what that is i'm not gonna sniff it because you never you never know do you but look at that oh that's named um if anyone knows what that says let me know in the comments not a hundred percent it is labeled wow cannabis <laughs> cannabis so it might all be different drugs and that that were in these on this single bed wow you ever seen anything like that cannabis coming in those little pots the wash basins here more artwork oh it is a shame that it's been trashed up here another bedroom here house is just so big look at the artwork somebody's been drawing lamps there Ah, right okay so this is the last room from this corridor but check that out that is insane amazing to see that little drug stash there what's this one then anything in here no nope, just tipped over wardrobes oh what's behind there hey Derek you seen these what? little uh, pots it's got like cannabis written on them and stuff really? tiny little in the, uh, just didn't like put away on that bed oh. right let's head this way past this ivy coming down oh this house is absolutely massive another bedroom here oh wow it's got the desks this newspaper from 1886 wow 1886 all like records here 19 no excuse me oh it's a price I thought it was a year then 16 something but you can see these wash basins wow marble fire look at the age of some of this stuff in here though guys completely back in time up here there you go piss pots thermometers oh that one's actually got ye old piss in it so I'm not going to touch that is that like a fencing mask? I do think it is, you know, guys. An old fencing mask. Wow, books. The bed here. The conversation. Paris. So many bedrooms as well. And look, hidden in here, another bookshelf. House is just completely full of books. Ugh. It's like a complete sat dictionary. The conversation. Wow so dusty as well this is insane the age of this house and the stuff in here old toilet there it's actually porcelain around the top there it's stamped that's so cool we have a couple more rooms i'm not sure just seem to go on forever <sighs> look at this place guys sorry it's so dark but it's just adding to it for me 
<gasps> oh my days. What? It's the pet dog. Oh my. Um. That is insane. Is that taxidermied or mummified? Oh my. That's mental. That has actually thrown me off. Look at him just lying on the bed. The family pet. It's quite heavy that guy. It's just to walk in and see the family pet. It's not something you see every day. Wow. Just gonna carry on, I suppose. See what dates we can find on these. But look how old these books are. It's so hard to just not look at this dog right now. <laughs> I'm struggling. Check the bed though, big oak bed. The big wardrobes. Anything in them? Ah, oh, we've actually got shoes. Looks like some drawings. Oh, whoa! Let me get that, let me get that. Oh my days, they are amazing. Wow. Look at that, that's some talent there, whoever's drawn these. That is absolutely amazing. I wonder if that's a family member. These are like uh, historical figures. Maybe this one is too, but wow. What a find that is. Old hand-drawn pictures from God knows when. Wow. And then just uh, bark at there. <laughs> Just chilling on the bed. Yeah, let's see if the lads have seen these. Have you seen these drawings? Nobody's there. Hello? Oh my days. Right, I'm gonna go in here, because I'm on my own now, I think. Oh, last bedroom, check this out. Desk, all the paperwork still on here. More books. All handwritten. Wow, that is amazing. That dog's completely thrown me off. And the fact that they've left now, <laughs> left me on my own. But check this bed out, nice big oak wooden bed again. The pillows piled up there, cobwebs drooping down. Ah, oh, is that a, diary, um, a calendar from 1876? No. Completely made that up. 1897. Don't know why I said that then. The old porcelain doll. And look at this jacket hung up. Wow. That is insane. What a house this is. Honestly. On face value you'd think it was trashed. But when you come and look inside. Absolutely amazing. Right there you have it guys. We are going to leave it here. We have had a quick walk through the house. This place is insane. Some of the history. Hundreds of years old. The family pet. The drawings. The, I love the old bottles with the uh, cannabis and stuff like that written on it. The wild boar taxidermy. <sighs> insane. It is so dark outside now. So we're just going to end it in the house. This place has been amazing. I hope you've enjoyed it. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Hit notification for future explores. We are done for the day. Back at it tomorrow. Hope to see you there. Have a nice week. Cheers.